Well, I never got a paid job for seven years after leaving drama school. They never knew what to do. I, I, I did a lot of crime monthlies. <laughs> I did every crime in London and got caught for them. Michael Caine always said that actors suffer more rejection than anyone else apart from door-to-door -door salesmen, and he thinks it's probably true. Some directors um, are afraid of inter interfering and some jump straight in. The, the one that I work best with is Mike because he understands what actors do more than any other director I've ever known. So what he does is he, he will ask you to change certain aspects of the physicality because, he, because he's, he's so in tune with what you're thinking as well. There's no good having a director who comes in and asks me to change the aesthetic if he has no idea what I'm thinking. You're given no excuse to fail. You know, you're given every facility to create a character, so if you're crap, it's, it's you. <laughs> I always start with the thoughts, and I don't start with a kind of choreography. I never start with the aesthetic. As an actor, I don't work from the aesthetic inwards. I start from inwards and allow whatever comes aesthetically, whatever looks right, to allow it to be. And then if I need to shape it in any way, I allow the director to shape it, or I shape it. But I just, what I end up doing really is just start with the thoughts and, and have the courage to allow that to manifest itself in, in whatever way it does. Praff can sound really arty and sound really pretentious, but if uh, a cabinet maker spoke about his craft, you wouldn't think of it as pretentious. Or if a painter spoke about his craft. And the reason actors, if you think about their craft, is because there's this great um, mythological um, mystique to it. People think that it's something that's, that they could never do, and I'm not a great believer in that. I'm, uh, you know, drama schools charge £20,000 a year to go there, and if, if it's something you can't teach, why are they charging £20,000 a year? It's something you, you can do, it's a process, it's a process that you learn. I'm sure that some people have a predisposition, uh, a characteristic that is more suitable to acting than other things. You have to be comfortable being the centre of attention, you have to be comfortable on stage. But actually the craft of acting, the actual doing of acting, is something that you can learn.